Okay, this is, uh, I just kind of want to explain to people what my, um, my YouTube channel is all about. Um, it's, I, I'm recording things as I can, as they happen. I'm putting pictures on it and giving you the backstory to the pictures from my first haunting a year ago. And I want this to be an educational channel. I want people who are seriously concerned that they may be going through a haunting and don't know where to turn. They don't know what's happening. They think they're losing their mind, um, like I did. I thought I was going crazy. And my wife, who's an ordained minister, thought that blessing the house and ignoring everything was the best course of action and would not let me talk to her about what was going on. So I was really, really um, stressed out and just felt like I was losing it. Um, so the, the only thing I could do was get on YouTube. Um, my Facebook friends, nice, great people, I love them all, but they really didn't seem like they cared that much about it. They asked me questions and say, wow, that sucks, but I wasn't getting a lot of reference help from them. Um, which is okay. I mean, it's a sensitive subject. You know, people don't want to talk about it. Um, so what I did was I went to YouTube and I started looking for haunting videos. Now, I didn't believe in the paranormal. I tried to, I really did, but I just didn't. And um, so I was having to sit through all the crap on YouTube, you know, where all these fake... These people are going out and manufacturing noise and have their friends around the property they're investigating making noise and you know just to boost their views because you know subs equal money you know so that wasn't helping me um and i don't want to say any names because i don't want to cast aspersions on anyone's name and i don't want to dissuade anyone from watching these videos because they are fun to watch <sighs> my neighbor's dogs are barking um so I found the Foreman Brothers. And one thing that I liked was that even though they did go to like the haunted sanitarium or the haunted school or the haunted hospital or whatever, they did regular people um, who were being haunted. And the first thing they would do is they would sit down and point the camera at them and have them talk. Have them sit, tell them, tell the camera what's going on in their house. And they wouldn't really talk. They would let them talk. And I really loved that because I got so much information that way. And I was like, oh, tapping, yeah, I'm, I'm getting that. Scratching, yeah, I'm getting that. Um, banging on the walls. Uh, see, uh, seeing actual apparitions in my house. You know, I could cross-reference what was going on in my house with all these other normal, just everyday people. So that's what I want. If I had had my channel, a year ago, when my first haunting happened, I'd have been golden. I would have had it made. I would have, had, I would have known what was going on. I would have known how to deal with it. I would have had references to legitimate, good legitimate groups to help me. But I didn't have that. If it's out there, I couldn't find it. And I went through a whole lot of videos. So I was really happy to... Uh, you know, find the Foreman Brothers and, and the information that I got from them. And I was able to use a lot of that to put my, not really put my mind at ease because now I knew what was going on. But um, it, it helped me to understand how to move forward. So that's what I'm hoping my channel is going to do. Now, you know, I'm, I would say I want to catch activity as it happens. And, you know, that's, uh, that's second most. First and foremost, I want to help other people. I want people to realize they're not losing their minds. Um, uh, all of these hauntings and all of these occurrences that happen in these haunted houses are all really similar. So what's happening in one house is very likely happening in another one. So think about it that way. And of course, if anything dramatic happens that you know I don't manufacture, I'll gladly put it in a video. Thanks a lot.